three NASA astronauts and one cosmonaut who spent months at the International Space Station are heading back to Earth in a SpaceX Dragon capsule. Two of the astronauts have been stranded since June when problems arose with Boeing's new Starliner capsule. Eyewitness News reporter Michelle Fisher joining us now with the latest on their return flight. Michelle. Mark, it is a return mission months in the making, and tonight we saw those live images from space. The beginning of the ending to this mission that was a lot longer than expected for Sonny Williams and Butch Wilmore. All hooks are open. And undocking confirmed. Freedom is free of its moorings. Sonny Williams and Butch Wilmore begin their belated trip home. A live NASA broadcast tonight showing the SpaceX Dragon undocking and departing from the International Space Station for a return to Earth. The uh, four departing Crew 9 crew members posing for some final photos. Those hugs and goodbyes at the hatchway earlier in the night as NASA astronaut Sonny Williams, Butch Wilmore, and Nick Haig, along with Roscosmos cosmonaut Alexander Gorbanov, loaded into the capsule for a return flight that's expected to last 17 hours. On behalf of Crew 9, I'd like to say it was a privilege to call Station home, to live and work and be a part of a mission and a team that spans the globe working together in cooperation for the benefit of humanity. Korean's going home. It's been a long-awaited return for Williams and Wilmore, who had been at the ISS since early June after they performed the first astronaut crewed flight for Boeing Starliner. What was supposed to be an eight-day mission extended, turning into nine months after issues with the Starliner, which was sent back to Earth unmanned in September. Yesterday, the SpaceX Crew-10 mission successfully docked at the ISS, setting up the overdue return for Williams and Wilmore. This after a hydraulic issue postponed the mission last week, less than 45 minutes before liftoff. Unfortunately, we're not going today. Williams and Wilmore now just hours away from a return home after 286 days in space. Prime moment is when those parachutes open. When you return to Earth uh, and your parachutes open, that is a great feeling. Yeah, and if all goes as planned, the Crew Dragon spacecraft is expected to splash down off the coast of Florida tomorrow evening around 557 Eastern. Make sure you stick with Eyewitness News for live coverage when that happens. Mark. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel and download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.